So I'm at ATS this morning. Supposed to be meeting tombs up here for a class. And as you can see, the parking lot is empty. I'm the only person in this parking lot. <laughs> Yo, I was sitting at the crib worried about being late for this thing, man. I should have known better dealing with tattoo artists, man. It is what it is, though. But we, uh, we filming this class today, and I'm, but I'm excited for a different reason. I got two new cameras. Well, they, they semi-new. I had them before. I had both of these cameras before. But I had to shake it up, man. I had to shake things up because it's too many times that I mean, I was shooting with the Fuji X-H1 that I didn't have enough quality when I needed it. So I had to, to get the two cameras that I knew would give me the quality. Now, the Black Magic camera, that is specifically for all of the quality that I can get. That's the best sub thousand dollar camera in the world. And anybody can quote me on that. Ain't nothing less than a thousand dollars that's that's better than the black magic, man. And, and and to be honest with you, it's not a lot of cameras over a thousand dollars that can match the black magic either, man. But problem with the black magic is you can't be a hybrid shooter and do video only. So you gotta make the decision whether you wanna be a videographer or a hybrid content creator. So, I got the Black Magic and I also got the Panasonic G7 for when I want to do photos. I got the G7, not only photos, but behind the scenes videos for this channel. The iPhone is cool. It doesn't work in, in certain situations like low light. It doesn't work in low light well. So, um, I got the Panasonic G7 to, to, to make sure that I'm delivering the best quality possible at all times and um, low light and everything. So, you know, we upgrade, man. Like I said, this is this series is me being transparent, going all the way from the bottom back to the top, baby. And this is how we do it. This is how we going to do it. So we got two cameras we rolling, and that's what it is, man. Y'all make sure y'all stay tuned. We about to film this class with tombs. And get busy. As Ric Flair would say, you might not be the first, but you could be the next. <laughs> woo! You got to hit him with the woo! Woo! <laughs> man over there now. Already. He got donuts, so he, he redeemed, man. You know. He brought the donuts through. But you brought some, yeah. some uh, fruit this time, too? Yeah, I always bring fruit for the healthy ones. <laughs> and pineapple. See, I'm a hybrid, man. I'm healthy and I, I want the donuts too. My first full day with the cameras, I ran out of batteries, I ran out of memory, I ran out of everything. So when I go home tonight, I gotta build the rig with the Black Magic Pocket Cinema camera. And I gotta figure out which SD cards is strong enough or fast enough for this Panasonic G7 and 4K. Um, it's been a while since I used each camera, so I kind of gotta gotta relearn them again and 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 figure it out. So today was a good was a good test though, you know, it was a good, it was a good sparring session for the, for the main event. We got, we got a lot of stuff coming up and I want to make sure that I'm equipped. The, the plus side to having two cameras now though is that I can start shooting podcasts. I can add that to my repertoire. I get a lot of people asking me about podcasts and to be able to provide that for my clients is a, is, is a no brainer. It's a winner. So uh, I'm adding that to my service list. I need to shoot a couple of them in studio so people can know what to expect when they come get a podcast shot from me. So that's next on the list, but we still got to build up above par visual, chief text visuals, uh, chief text photo. Um, we still got to get this merch moving. It's, it's a lot. It's a lot going on. And it's just me. Um, this go around, I might add some people to the team, but 
as soon as they give me an inkling of they not riding with the squad, then they got to go, man. So, like I said, we got a lot of things going on. And it can't just be, I feel like it can't just be me if I want to build it to where, where I say I want to build it to because I have to work in, in Fayetteville filming stuff for ATS this week, but I could have been in, in Indiana this week also with ATS just on a tattoo convention. So I have to figure out, you know, if I, if I can send somebody out there in my place to get the footage. If I, uh, you know, maybe I edit it, but you know, that's a free trip for somebody. That's something that I left on the table and then I'm, I'm pretty upset about. So I might have to build this thing to a full blown agency. I don't know yet, but we'll figure it out, man. All I know is I'm going full force and whatever comes, I'm going to take it. So today was cool, man. Um, Toombs got, he was teaching, you know, teaching techniques. They watched a, a technique video. Um, the whole shop was there almost, so that was it was a good turnout, and things are looking bright for ATS. Things are looking bright for Chief Tech's films, so we gonna keep pushing, man. But I got the Black Magic camera now, man. So now I'm, I feel like I feel confident now. I feel like I can I can tackle the world now because I got my I got my I got my shield and my sword back. You know what I mean? I don't have to. I'm not I'm not crippled by the the Fujifilm XH1. The Fujifilm XH1 is a great camera. Fuji is a great system, but it's just not suited for what I need it for, you know what I mean? Like when you're buying cameras, you got to buy for your needs and I just outgrew that camera with the direction I'm going now. When I bought it, I was going in the right direction for the xh1 but now that i want to build this agency man i gotta have the top-notch quality i gotta impress people i gotta really put my best foot forward and me behind that black magic camera that's where i'm comfortable at that's where i'm comfortable to take on any challenge thrown my way man so i'm excited about the future y'all should too man if you like videos like this make sure you subscribe to the channel Click that notification bell so you don't miss any more videos. I'm out, but y'all, y'all keep them cameras rolling, man.